Hey guys, guess who's back? So I've been away for in an over a year and this has been a crazy year at that. Um school work, you know, and I had a I honestly felt very doubtful about coming back to YouTube because I know there are a lot of other naturalistas, you know, on YouTube doing almost the same thing, but everyone has different hair types. And I still had the urge to, you know, film my journey to healthier, stronger hair. So I definitely made the decision yesterday to come back. And I'm actually pretty excited about it. And I've had a lot of ideas roaming through my head. And I just wanted to come back and let you know that <laughs> I wanted to let everyone know that I was coming back to YouTube. And I want to do this again. And um, I pretty much wanted to update you guys on what's been going so, on. So, with my hair, as you can see right now, I have my yarn braids in. I left the bottoms out because I honestly did not feel like burning them plus I like the length that it gave me so I kept it and it's been sticking with me this whole it's been about three and a half weeks so I think this week it'll be four and then Friday I'm taking them out because I cannot endure <laughs> this anymore um, my scalp has been itching I feel the need to just wash and deep condition my hair so this will definitely be the last week. I have a lot of new growth going on under here. And I've been trying to style it, as you can see, to try and cover it up. Um, other things. Yeah. This past March, I decided to try and straighten my hair, give it a go. I actually went to a professional salon. Um, and I was honestly not very happy with the results that it, he, he gave me. Um, separate he did my hair the way I wanted him to into sections. He did not, you know, detangle it the way that I wanted him to. He pretty much used a small tooth comb, which is deadly on a natural girl's hair. A small tooth, you know, just regular rat tail comb. And you can't do that. You, you damage the hair, you break it. And, um, he did trim my ends, which I was happy about. And, um... From then on out, I'm pretty just gonna, I'm pretty much going to dust them myself and look and clip them. Um, the hairstyle lasted half a day. Um, it started poofing up immediately afterwards. Um, it definitely did not last. So that's been that. I haven't done it since. I haven't attempted to straighten my hair. Um, I've been told that I should. But I'm probably not going to for quite some time because, one, I'm afraid of the heat damage that it may cause, and two, I want to make sure that it's done right the next time that I do um, decide to straighten my hair. So either I may try and do it myself with, you know, a steam flat iron if I can get a hold of one, or get someone who I trust to do it for me. Um, other than that, no more straight hair for this girl. Um, I have been protective styling. This is the second time I've done yarn braids this year. Um, and this past summer, well before school started, I decided to get Havana Twist with the Marley hair. And I loved the style. I got it professionally done. Again. <laughs> and um, it didn't last very long because um, my dry, itchy scalp just kind of overtook everything and I was scratching and I was messing up the hairstyle and I was trying to you know wash it put oil on it but for some reason my scalp was just not responding well so um, I have an oil that I'm trying to use up now um, and I'm gonna try tea tree oil next to hopefully you know that'll work well on my scalp because it's just soaking up everything that it can and then after half a day my scalp is already flaking and I just I don't know what to do so if anyone out there has some advice for me please 
let me know. Um, but you know what? As far as my flat ironing pictures, my Havana twists, I'm going to insert some pictures right now. Then there is my fitness. Um, as you guys know, before I was doing like the Wii and I was doing Jillian Michaels, I had bought the DVDs and um, actually I don't know if I told you guys I bought the DVDs. I bought three of Jillian Michaels DVDs. I bought the 30 Day Shred, the No More Trouble Zones, and Banishing Fat, something like that. And two or 40 minute workouts and the 30 day shred of course is the 20 minutes and I really liked them however after some time it just got really repetitive and really boring so right now I am back to going in the gym and I'm doing the elliptical for about 30 to 45 minutes depending on how I'm feeling that day or depending on what I'm doing afterwards and I also have this new workout app on my phone that I advise others to try because I really do like this app. You're sore, you feel a good workout, you're you're sweating, you're burning calories and um, it's called the Nike Training Club so if you have a phone that downloads apps which majority of people do um, look for that if you're looking for something you can do at home or even in the gym it's a good way to you know train and do different intervals and circuits so I like it a lot um, that's pretty much my journey I've been pretty much up and down with my weight before in the beginning of the year I was losing weight and then I gained it all back and plus some and then starting I want to say the end of August beginning of September I started working out majority of the day I want to say on average about four sometimes three three four times a week um, and I usually try and go hard in the gym when I do miss days so my eating habits and eh, no one's perfect <laughs> but I'm definitely working on it and I'm doing a lot better than I was so that's pretty much it I know the next video that I will be doing will be a products update um, things that I'm using now and I'm sorry <laughs> the football game is on so I'm kind of out there but um yeah just things have been okay I'm treating my hair better I'm deep conditioning every week my regimen now pretty much is washing and deep conditioning every week I may co-wash you know sometimes in between depending on how hard I work out or if I'm working out but I do it every week now and I'm still using um, the wind conditioner I'm trying to get rid of that because I do want to purchase a moisturizing shampoo and conditioner so that's what's going on with me I really did miss you guys I missed doing these videos I've been watching YouTube videos every single day and I'm just like man I really miss doing this even though you know I'm not as popular or you know well known on YouTube this is something I like doing so I'm definitely gonna try and stick to it I'm definitely not gonna try and let you know other naturals doing YouTube videos intimidate me because this is something I like to do so it's great to be back um, and I will see you guys soon most definitely so love you guys talk to you later bye